I feel like it's been a couple of months since I last were here. What happened last time? Uh, let me see. We've been through temples, bases, tunnels, sewers, uh, creeks, and I think that covers it. It looks like we went out the back door of the robot factory, and, and uh, we're back in nice, la nice place land. Also, say hello to the bees. Oh no. Oh no, not the bees. Are you sure they're not wasps? Well, they are the platformer bees, is what I mean. Like, they feel that oh, Jesus! of oh. being bees in the platformer. Stop storing the hornet's nest, literally. Yeah. I, I mean, you, you know my opinions on the very bad rap that bees get in video games. Well, they're annoying, so they're bees. Oh. Also, uh, spinning top. Bamboo bridges. Those I know. Those are in um, Sonic Generations. Uh. See, I, I knew you were right. We were, I was going to course come up with some Sonic stuff. I know those things are in Sonic Generations in Sky Sanctuary. In that I can't remember if they're in the original. Uh, yeah. I think in the original they're not quite spinning like that, but yeah, they're they're similar to those. Yeah. Okay. In, in the skies and the marbles and stuff. And you, you have that vertical spin axis in this game that actually makes it make sense. I guess I should mention this is a Lilac's unique level, so it's got a bunch of unique things for her. Like when she goes to one of those powery things, she gets a double boost. Oh, I thought okay. you were supposed to uh, find all of her kind and then that's like doing a, a prayer and then they have to hop jump through a portal. No. That's like the Well, not yet. <laughs> a Sega game that isn't Sonic. Yeah. It also gives her this attack and stuff, but mostly it's about to be able to boost longer so you can do these crazy gems. Uh. Which is nice. Although they kinda really like using it. So is there any story reason as to why those portals are there or are they just there? They're there. That sounds about right. <laughs> I, I think they are trying to imply that Lilac has a bigger role in all of this and just being a spunky teenager, but uh... I don't know. So anime. Yeah. This is this is Lilac's magic hand. Yep. Or something. Well, thank Christ! I thought you were just gonna keep uh, jumping up and down just to get those leaves. <laughs> well, I, I tried to control myself for these videos, <laughs> but that's usually how I play these games. Oh yeah. no! Also, the super duper whatever you want to call it jump is kind of tricky to control so sometimes I end up having to do it a bunch. Mm. I see you're not lagging in uh, extra lives. Well eight. you say that now. Oh dear. It seems a respectable number. Yeah that's probably still true until the end. Well look on the bright side if you were playing blackjack that would be a really cool life total to have. If, if if blackjack had a life total, <laughs> and you had to what get kind of to what kind life. of casinos are you going to, Paul? Where you need a life total of more than well, one? Well, casino night zone, obviously. Obviously. Oh, we have a guest. Oh, oh yes, of course. This is the this is the main benefit of having Scotch uh, LP. Yes, yeah, so you always come with the best commentary. To be yeah. Fair. I'm just gonna have your cat take over. So what, what do you think of, of motorcycles, Scotch's cat? I don't think she has any comments to that. Oh. I think she left again. Ruined forever. Ah, uh, there we go. Yes, I also feel the same way. I, I see. I like how we were mo paying more attention to whether or not the cat was going to say something than the fact that you just got fired off on a giant bow. Yeah, we're going to see those a bunch. Kinda of tricky to jump on for some reason. Oh. I don't like these enemies pretty. though. They do look a bit mean. Yeah, they're basically health sponges and the only way to quickly kill them is if you have the super boost or the arrow. Otherwise you just have to goof around for a bit. And they're all over the place, so they're annoying. And they got like big shields on their uh well, shoulders? Yeah, and spikes which you don't want to touch. Yeah. 
I wonder if anyone will ever do a video game where it's a good idea to touch spikes. Uh, that is a good question. What if it's a game about a drug addict and it's uh, needles instead of spikes? Well, usually the message is you don't want to touch the drugs. So. I mean, there is but, like yeah, but we also live in a time where you have to be edgy. Boy. Yeah, that's true. What if they're insulin dependent? Oh yeah. You well, can make what it... if they're diabetic? I mean, it could be the great reboot to cat uh, to Captain. Uh, what was it, diabetes or what was Captain it? Captain Novalin, wasn't it? No, Captain yeah. Novalin, that was it. Yeah. God, that was a hell of a game. I should even uh, remember that because it, uh, Novalin is produced in Denmark, I think. Goddamn bees! Oh. Just like this game was! Seriously, what is oh, going on in Denmark, Scotch? Stuff. I don't even fucking know anymore. Although I think you've kind of become infamous since you made that weird game about slavery on <laughs> Oh, if only you knew. If only I knew. <laughs> Do you sort of load into this one back? No. I thought you were going to load into it via the ramp, via the half pipes, but... No. Hey! That's one of your weird, unsuccessful clones. <laughs> I wonder why do they keep them trapped everywhere. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what you do. You're using their stem cells. My god, this game is so ahead of its time. It suddenly all makes sense. Yes, that's the word I'd use. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we should bring this one to life. We should make this life so we can harvest stem cells for it. Now kill it! We have a patient we need to save. I don't care if it's sentient life. Well, we don't know if it's... I mean, it seems happy to see you, so I suppose it might... Yeah, it's sentient. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Oh, a mystery thing. Another mystery thing. Wow, we got a, a choice of shields. Yeah, so I just end up taking them all and ruining the mystery. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure why... I'm sure they're just trying to show so a thing here, because right after this there's more shield anyway. Uh, <laughs> so do they so stack? Do they stack all the shields, or no. it's just replacing? I think they're just trying to be uh, thematic about this. Mm. They're like, well, they, it, we, we don't have a Master Emerald Shrine, so they still have to do. <laughs> I am not good at these. Uh, yeah, this kind of looks annoying. Oh. oh dear! Well, luckily, if you fuck up, you just end up on the lower path. And bees have also infested this place. Oh, yeah, I should warn you, the lower pad is basically bees. My god. Also, these... Arkanoid-type things, for some reason. You'll see them more later. And oddly enough, this time, the, the bees become eyes. And they are not in the eyes. Yeah, there is a lot of... I remember doing a, a dingbat one time that was just like a couple of bees, like a drawing of a couple of bees, and inside the bees were little eyes. But yeah, I think it's like we're in some kind of hive, I guess. Oh, which is a bad place Christ. to be in. <laughs> because, you know, I like my puns. Yes. Let's all forget oh, wow. those puns. And now it's a winter. No. <laughs> oh, last second save there. Those tours were not very effective, were they? Let's have them right next to each other. This well, the thing. real question is, what the hell is all of this stuff? <laughs> okay, that uh, you got to admit, it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good gimmick for an enemy. Oh, great king! How oh. shall how shall the great bee house? Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's the a lot of fucking bees everywhere. Well, the background ones don't count. Okay. Let's just imagine it goes like this. So. The great hall of bees, your majesties. What should the temple be like? Have a place where they're just blocks that uh, hit invisible walls constantly. <laughs> why not? And why is that my king? I am the king, and I decree such. 
I agree B's for everyone. The king was just really bad at breakout, so he wanted a game of breakout you couldn't lose. Let's try that again. <laughs> yep. Let's try cheating that again. Nah, it didn't work. But at least you get another crap! Well, let's get rid of these guys first. They <laughs> are like, oh my god, why are we... Why? Who put us here? Who put those two rings either side of us? It is the best when they do that. Worst guard duty ever. Nope. They're getting a lot of mileage out of these disappearing blocks. Yep. And these appearing bees. <laughs> they just keep coming out the background, maybe. Oh. Well, that, that one bee wow, this like, looks really gonna... annoying. I mean, the most annoying thing isn't it just their bees, it's just really the sound they make. Like, you know, like that twitch you get when you hear like a mosquito or something? It's yeah. Kind of yeah. So, of course, video games gotta do them and make you hit the hives and ah, bees. You didn't have to do that. Well, I mean, the arrow hit the hive. That's Why? Good, yeah. Why did they I mean... feel the need to put those many goddamn bees here? Well, hives do have a lot of bees in them. Yeah, but it's a game. True. It's a game full of bees. That's my well, no, that's my th th this game understands video understands bees better than most video games with bees in them. I mean, that's a scary part. I'm not sure what the deal is with those flowers either, but they keep respawning. Awesome. Something I don't like enemies to do. Uh, yeah, that's fair. Does the video game goddammit stay dead? Uh, and giant swords, sure. Yep. Well, let's just have giant swords in the beehive. Wait, not the sword in the beehive. Obviously, this place is just beyond our comprehension. Ouch. Yeah, I thought it was a platform, but yeah. No. I, I was going ouch because beyond, but it might just be me. Oh, don't senses. be such a bee about it, Paul. Bee head. <laughs> <laughs> I do not be long here. Well, now continue the rest of the video just with bees. <laughs> New guest commentator, bees. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's more fly than bee. So there was no. I noticed it. There was no mini boss on this level then. You just sort of had those shields and that was it. Yeah, that is an interesting note that there's no. I mean, these guys are pretty annoying, so. But yeah, this is, I think, the one level without a mini boss, I'm not sure. Hmm, interesting. If there was one that, and it was cut, and that's why all the kill shields were there, or they just went, eh, we, we got enough health sponges. They're just here. like, they're just saying, yeah, these are the Chaos Emeralds for their shields. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Don't have a lot of health left. Oh, I'll be fine. Oh. Oh. You've got one half. Slip of, of life, yeah. A slip of a leaf. A leaf life. Life leaflet. A half life. Which reminds me, when do you get the crowbar in this game? I think all the doors are lever activated. Uh. Ah, there ah, we there go. go. Half-Life 3 confirmed. Oh yes. god, Paul. Oh. <laughs> that's that's even more painful than your puns. I'm sorry. That's no, wait, I'm not sorry. You should be sorry. Okay. Sorry. This is a bit of an annoying part. You need to get up there with the boost, but the boost isn't exactly uh. easy to aim, so you just kind of... Oh, oh dear. Keep doing this for a bit. Why can't you just go through the door? <laughs> because you oh, got to pet out the game They put a lever in an unreachable place for some reason. Who you designed need... this place? <laughs> Dragons? I don't know. Bees? Bees. 
Well, yeah, bees can fly. They don't have to worry about this. They think this is a perfectly logical place to put their doorknob. Well, given everything is also designed for you, I think they're implying a lot. You're part of something. They're implying you're a bee. You're actually a bee, yes. <laughs> I nearly there thought she was a cat all along. This can't be possible. No, no, it's the That's key a really bee. Large bee. <laughs> And yeah, this Queen, is surely. this is a boss that a lot of people dislike because, uh, well, you saw that uh, red, all that red stuff in its back. You gotta hit all of them. Oh. Uh, all of them. Well, 99 percent. Besides that, the boss is really just about uh, constantly spamming the and running. So yeah, it's just kind of yep. Which is a shame because I, I the rest of the level was actually quite. Uh, yeah. Although those giant eye, if only you could harness the bees and then and then you could put them in its giant eyes. The bees Which are in my eyes. Seems like a that laser did not hurt you at all. Yeah, you, while you're boosting, you're invulnerable. Which I think is pretty much the only way to dodge the laser cell. Ah. Oh yeah, this looks really annoying as once they start being fewer and fewer. Yeah, it's like they have these boost p uh, pads, rings up here, so you could just like keep boosting and it's not like he lights up with them, so yeah. it's a lot of random luck. Although if you, if you want, you can just keep spamming boost forever up there, but... Oh, oh, oh. We'll slowly get him. At least the music's nice. Yeah, I see. I was thinking it's a pretty good one. Very energetic. Why was he yelling, uh, how is this possible? I don't know, have you ever seen a bee that big? <laughs> I haven't seen a bee that looks like a dragon, no. Well, there you go. How is this possible? The, the How is this the, game the possible? A, the area to volume ratios are all wrong. <laughs> I noticed, by the way, that uh, your lives counter has uh, decreased. Nah, oh, that's just your don't, don't point that out. Don't point that out. <laughs> I've, I've learned this the hard way. Uh. We do not speak of alternate timelines. <laughs> You're back down to half life again. Will I make it? I'm going to assume so, unless you're gonna in uh, the next minute gonna replay a new level where you just beat it. Well, you never know. I might save that for later. Oh, oh no, his eyes flashing. Yep, we we got enough of the things down, so now we gotta hit the next blink. Oh. I'm not sure if that can be considered good design. Just hit the blinking things. Yeah. Well, I mean, I wouldn't wanna guess what the blinky things are, but you know, you had zero life, but then so does it. Yes. All 25 minutes. And good old tradition, it explodes. Ah, it's uh, a hologram. And the plot thickens. It thickens with bees. The plot thickens just as the holo as the dragon thins out into a hologram. She does look appropriately confused. Oh yeah. 